I'm Nelson Heller. I'm the president of EdNet and the Heller Report at MDR. The thing that I uh, that comes to mind was going to a meeting in Chicago, which may have actually been the Information Industry Association before the uh, SPA and SIIA uh, and the Information Industry Association and the SPA uh, joined together was the online uh, reference databases that were the harbinger of online and electronic publishing at the time. And um, many of them were medical references and uh, government products that had been converted into electronic databases. Um, but it was quite fascinating uh, to see a new uh, cadre of business players coming in with this content and a new way of delivering this information that really added value uh, to the users. And I think it's just gone on from there. I, I've thought about this, and for me, I think the most consequential uh, event has been uh, the advent of the internet. Uh, I remember seeing the first um, mosaic browser and trying to understand what that was about. But it has, and, and learning um, uh, how to find it using my computer with this arcane HTTP colon slash slash and uh, like moving into a foreign language. But in fact, it's provided a, a portal, a platform, a vehicle for virtually, for changing virtually or enhancing every aspect of our business, of the content, of the marketing, of the um, delivery of the service. Uh, so for me, I think that's made a very big difference. It's made a very big difference at these meetings and, and for our industry. Yeah, I've also thought about that quite a lot. And I didn't think of a single theme, but of what the world, the market, will be like, what products will be like at that time. And, and that will define the kinds of companies that are here, the kinds of topics that are here. Uh, and some of the elements that I think are going to be a part of that world in five years are um, blended learning, blended in the sense of a combination of electronic and physical, uh, virtual, uh, and face-to-face -face that uh, and uh, print materials supported by essentially things doing what they do well and that uh, we won't have one replacing the other but the best combination. A lot of this will be in the cloud. People will be able to access uh, their learning experiences uh, from a host of devices, um, start on one device, pick up where they left off on another device. Um, the learning will be much more uh, individualized and participative than it is now. Uh, a kind of um, prescriptive um, customization that this industry has been involved in since the early integrated learning systems, but finally uh, much more coming to fruition uh, in terms of all of the functionality that is necessary uh, to make it work. Um, companies will have to deal a lot more with uh, other people's platforms for delivering their material, partnerships, um, the wireless world, which we're hearing a lot about 
at this con concept. Uh, and selling is going to be a lot more electronic than it is now. Um, what is e-marketing today, uh, I think, is just the beginning of um, ways of developing relationships with customers, supporting those relationships, and closing sales. Um, and I also think in the the result of our economic downturn, uh, which the, the specifics of which are harder to predict, is that our industry is going to reset to a new reality. Uh, we're, the economy is going to recover, but we're not, we're not going back to where we've come from. The um, economic forces listening to some of this stuff about open source, uh, about what technology may make possible, uh, about the pressure that um, schools are under, are really uh, going to create um, a new reality. So when we come together in five years, uh, and God willing, the economy has recovered, it's really going to be reset to this new reality uh, that will be a big focus of, of that kind.